Hi Scrappers, it's Muriel here. So I wanted to come and show you a project that I've been working on. I told you guys that I was making some wall art for my daughter's apartment when she goes back to school in September. So I wanted to show you where I am with that. And then um, one of my co-workers today gave me a huge box um, that had some beautiful belongings uh, from her mother-in-law who um, passed away maybe two years ago. They're just kind of going through her um, craft room of stuff. So um, every now and again, she just blesses me with some beautiful things. So I wanted to show you those. And then I just wanted to, and hopefully I'm talking to a uh, newer audience, <laughs> as well as uh, my regular subscriber friends. But I still have some lace packs. And I just don't want you ladies to miss out because this is some beautiful black um, lace. This was, um, I bought it from a D stash, a whole lot of it, and I decided to break it up and uh, spread the wealth. And um, this one here has five beautiful um, designs of laces that I have wrapped on a Prima tag. So there's, um, this one here is probably an inch and a half and then this beautiful flowers uh, trim here same thing about inch and a half two inches and then they have this one here with some um, a, a I don't know what this is I keep saying I want to say Angora I don't know why I want to say Angora this is not Ango Angora but um, that's a pattern and this is uh, like three yards and then I have this beautiful two inch uh, piece here with this really um, edge is like frayed so lots of black lace and certainly the holiday not so much Christmas but Halloween uh, if you like altering hats if you like making flowers um, certainly this lace is the lace you're going to want for those projects and then my second pack, same thing, 18, um, has this beautiful stretchy cream lace. And there is a black, four other black ones. This is a really um, small um, lace trim. And then this one here. Now I made some flowers. You can check back on my videos. I sat here and just whipped up four flowers. Um, from using these trims so it's really pretty so I just want you know you guys to know that I still have it if you want to take advantage of it I am selling it again via PayPal only US only so you just need to um, send me your um, PayPal and I will get out a invoice to you but speaking of laces let me show you what my friend uh, gave me today just some pretty appliques that I cannot wait to use. That's a pretty one there. I've been watching a lot of or seeing a lot of jars, altered jars, mason jars that have lace and crocheted lace on them and um, it made me think of this. Look at that pretty bow. Right and then there is some trim, some really funky trim that would look cute on the edge of something. Right, so just a piece, but you know, sometimes that's all you need. That looks like a queen's crown to me. And then these doilies, of course, I will cut them, but aren't that isn't that pretty? Very dainty. Then there's a piece of this trim here, this reminds me of an eyelet trim. And this is a crocheted, I don't know if it's like a collar, right? And it's like a really tan pretty tan color and then there are two of these crocheted pieces they kind of look heart shaped right so two of those and then this piece here a little thinner heart shaped doily and then this really nice um, I think it has hearts on it um, like a tool so I have an idea what to do with this this is really pretty so there's a nice piece of that. And then there were these um, 
pieces here. This is a three by three, and I tried to read it on the back what they were. Um, rag spun quilting. So they're red, circle, and there's three different ones here. Two of the same size and then this larger one. So Stephanie, thank you so much. Every time you think about me and call me up there to your office, I am like elated. So here's a project that I'm working on for my daughter's apartment. I saw the idea over on Michelle 1918 or something like that channel. Um, I watch her. She does a lot of beauty um, videos and hauls and stuff like that. And in her bedroom or wherever she was videoing, the dresser had some makeup um, trays, but on the background she had some framed handbags. Which I thought, and I say handbags, I mean shopping bags. So I went to Michael's and bought some frames. Now this is just the paper bag from Pink. If you ever shop at Pink, which we do all the time, my daughter loves Pink. You know, it's a spinoff of Victoria's Secret. Then I had someone give me a Coach um, uh, um, box, and I cut it down and just put it in this black frame. I picked up this card at a craft store when I went last summer. It says, I love that you're my daughter. I never mailed her the card, but now it'll hang on the wall. Here's one from one of my friends bought something from Gucci. And um, that's just a like a envelope. And then I have some gold trim in the background. Gold paper. Here is a bag from Victoria's Secret. And then I just cut out this here because, you know, the bags have the fold line. So I didn't know how to get rid of it. So I just put that there. It says, Love, Victoria. And then another friend gave me a Kate Spade bag. <laughs> you know, I really appreciate them for parting with these bags because they, you know, they've had these for a while. So um, that's a real cute one there. And then um, we got a Nordstrom's bag. So I put it in this frame here. And this is where the fold line was, so I just put some washi tape and a uh, bling piece and then some um, star washi tape along the sides here. And then um, my friend gave me a Ann Taylor bag and I used some Patty's washi tape and then some black script writing washi tape. So I still have some more frames and some more bags that um, I'll be working on before September comes so we can get those finished. And this is what she's going to put on her wall. You know, they're really light. Um, I'm just going to put the Scotch Guard tape um, that you can put on the wall so that we'll have to put no nails in them. And I thought it will be, it, it'll be, it'll look really cute. I hope to um, show some photos when it's all done. So Stephanie, thank you again for these yummy, yummy goodies. And again, if you're interested in any of these lace packs, they are $18 US only, PayPal only. Just leave me your information and I'll be sure and get it out in the mail to you. So thanks again for watching everyone. Bye now.